Okay guys, welcome back to WRC3 here in Finland. If you missed the last rally and you want to check that one out in New Zealand, there's a link down below in the description for that rally, so please buy, be my guest and go check it out. So uh, I'll go confirm here and we're on into Finland. Into Finland now, it's one of my favourite rallies. Here in Finland, the con your concentration needs to be very high and very perfect here because... Uh, well, not very perfect, but uh, it's a very fast rally, and the slightest mistake can cost you big time here in Finland. So, so I'm hoping uh, we don't make any of them mistakes. But uh, hope you guys are having a great day and enjoying your, you know, enjoying yourself so far. Or if you're having a bad day, maybe this video might, you know, pick you up a little. If it does, that's fantastic. As we, yeah, we are. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. I, well, I saw what happened, I just don't really know what to say about it. But uh, as we're coming to the end of the first split, where are we? Eighth? Uh, one, nearly one and a half seconds off the pace. That's uh, not not to worry, because uh, I tell you, it's not as bad as it was on the first stage in New Zealand. So, left three long and 60, yep. Trees inside and right six. I'll take. Yeah, there we go. Can we? There, uh, yeah, that's fine. I thought I was going to go sliding off into the trees there for a moment, but. Uh, okay, so that's good. We we've lost a tiny, tiny fraction amount of time, but we've moved up a few positions. So. Not to worry. Left three don't cut yet. There's going to be trees that I came way too close to them for my liking. And left two, yep. Yeah. There we go. Can we? What's the handbrake button again? I can't remember. It's been it's been a few days since I played this again. Oh, yeah, that was close. I thought we were gonna go sliding off into something. Building outside. The right four opens. That's yes. Okay, so we lost a bit more time, but it's not to worry. Not to worry, we're still in the top five so far. Oh, yeah, this is getting very quick through here now, isn't it? We need to slow it down there a little. And of course, it's in kilometers an hour. I might have to change that to miles an hour if I can. I don't know why I haven't changed it sooner, but... Uh, Forty left four. Okay, so I don't, we're not gaining time, but we're not losing positions. So at the end of the day, it's not a problem. We, if we can keep this up, stay right about where we are, collect the points, move on to the next rally, and then make a charge at the championship. You know, very soon. I had to slow down there because I, I wanted to. Well, I didn't want to crash. So forty and left five. Yep, I'm focusing so hard here. There we go, and we're across the line. P5 at the end of the first stage. Not bad. I'll take P5, but uh, yeah, Miko Havenen's leading the rally. We are 3.2 seconds off the pace, but uh, we're ahead of Yari Mati Latvala, and we're the fastest uh, Fiesta so far, as Sebastian Loeb is in second. Uh, yeah, so we'll, well, uh, Mads Osberg rounds out the top 10 with Oik Tanak, so as far as it goes, I think we've, well, we've got three car, four cars in the top 10, and Citroen's only got three, so we're doing well so far for Ford, but uh, yeah, I will see you guys for stage number two. Okay then, so stage number two is here, and uh, yeah, we didn't have much damage to repair on the car, which is very strange for us. So, um, um, I don't know how this stage is going to go. We finished P5 in stage number one. So, yeah, it, it, it might be, it might work out to where this rally is probably going to be better. You know, not better. Um, where this stage might be better, we might be. I'm aiming for maybe another top five. Another, another solid top five in stage number two, and maybe, or maybe even. 
maybe even a top three just if we're gonna stretch it but uh but yeah those are some pretty neat neat jumps there aren't they so right three very long yep titans middle did you say oh look at that we're in the top three so far we're splitting the citrons and sebastian oh well no we're not splitting the citrons we're trailing the Citrons and Sebastian Oshihe in a VW Polo. Okay, just cut the corner slightly there because, well, I'm a rally driver, so why not? Okay, yep, yep. Slide it, slide it, yep. Now, that, that could have ended badly. That could have ended badly. At least I'm not trying to drive flat out everywhere. Slow it down. As I say that, I make a big mistake there. Trees inside, yeah. Keep middle. Ah, oh, that's nice. Don't narrows, please. Okay, we're down to P5. Get back on the on the gravel. Yeah, I didn't keep middle. I didn't keep middle. We saved it. We saved it. Into right three long. Oh yes, I can fly. I've got an achievement. Wow. Okay, that's um. Oh, no, no, slow it down, slow it down. Yeah, this stage isn't going very well. I should have I should have listened to the co-driver. It's all right, we're in P3 in the championship standings so far. I don't know how that's going to translate, you know, later on in this championship. I, I don't know, I, it's going to be risky if we're going to... Well, I think it's going to be close if we can win the championship, but... Uh, yeah, P4, P7 so far. That's not what you really want to see, is it? Out of somebody that's driving Pet Solberg's car. Okay, so yeah. I've got a bit of a... I, I need to cough, but I'm not going to do it on, on camera. I'm going to try and wait. Well, wait slightly. You see, I never get a drink for these, but when I'm recording, I should really, really, really do that as I'm going to... Oh, I was about to say I was going to hit a tree, but I, I wasn't. Well, I didn't hit the tree, but I thought I was going to, but... There we go. Left four and 40. Okay, me recording... Ah, oh, no, it, it, it does a little... Every now and then, it, it skips a few frames, but... Uh, but it doesn't show up on the recording, you know, the actual end product, so I won't be too worried about, worried about it. And we are across the line for P5, and we got a green sector, I saw. So, yeah, um, P5, so, okay, that's two fifth places in a row. Loeb uh, might take the, no, Loeb doesn't take the lead in the rally. It's close, though. It's about three tenths of a second between the two teammates at the top. We're in P5, putting a bit of distance between us and our teammate Latvala, but we're dropping slightly off the pace of Sordo. Um, Ogier's still there or thereabouts with the Citroëns, but I don't know, it's going to be tough for anybody to beat Citroën today. 6.1 seconds off the lead after two stages. What can we do in stage number two? I mean three, sorry. Yeah, We've just had stage two. You see, my mind's not really ready for this rally. Okay, stage number three, I believe, uh, here in the Petter Solberg season here in Rally Finland. We are underway, hoping to do better than P5 in this stage. Um, it's going to be tricky, though, um, because on WRC3, uh, the least experience I've ever had was it, it's with Rally Finland. So, yeah, so to finish P5 in the first two stages, that is fantastic. But I, I feel like it. I should. I should have more experience on WRC3. Look at the ca the camera getting closer to the car because how quick we're getting. It's a beautiful looking Fiesta. Let's hope I can keep it that way. And uh, yeah, I've just think, been thinking. We've won two stages, no, two rallies this season, and uh, it seems like every rally, you know, 
rally season I've done on across any of the WRC games, I actually win at least one rally every season, which is surprising, really, when you think about it, when you think that I'm not very good at these games. So I've already proven that by actually sh you guys watching my videos, I'm not very good. Okay, so this is going to... This corner, I think, tightens, doesn't it? So we slow it down. Slow it down, slow it down. There we go. Left three long. Yep. Use the handbrake slightly because I don't want to have any accidents. Right four, keep middle. Yeah, that was close. I might actually do an F1 2012 season at some point. Oh, another F1 other than Championship Edition and, uh, no, actually, no, I might have to, yes, I remember. I remember what I was actually going to do. Yeah, I remember. It was F1 1995, or Formula One, as it is, on the PS1. I was going to do a series on that. And I never got round to it. I might have to, and th there's so many different series I'm, you know, planning on coming to the channel. I might get a few, through a few series first. I've got Star Trek to put up. You know, um, yeah, yeah, that's one thing. I've got Star Trek, you know, the video game to put up at some point. I keep forgetting about that as well. Um, I actually have one recorded for later on. Not Probably not today or, well, no, it won't be today because... As you guys watching this, this is WRC that goes up. Right four. Yes, that's nice and sweet through there. What's our time going to be? Are we going? Yes, P4. That's exactly what we need. I'm not bothered about winning the rally. Just finish well. We finish close to the championship contenders. Or the protagonists, as people would say. Yep, that's right. That's nice through there. Okay, this stage is going well. Right six into left six. I still slow down on the right fives, even though you could probably take them, you know, a bit quicker. And we're coming to the end of the stage. There we go. End of the stage. P4. A place better than we did in the previous two stages. Okay, so... Sebastian Loeb will take over the lead of the rally here in Finland after that fantastic stage win. That's his second stage win in a row. Miko Haven in second by eight tenths of a second. The Citroens are in a league of their own today, so P4 was probably the best we could have got, or P3, so. But we move up to P4 in the standings. Loeb takes the lead by four tenths of a second. Uh, the, there's a bit of light between, you know, Augier and the Citroens and me and Augier but we couldn't get that back coming into stage number four I think so let's see how we go there okay stage number four here in Rally Finland stage number four car number four is on its way through stage number four and I kept saying stage number four quite a lot but uh, but yeah um, that's not really a big barrier outside although it's there for a reason to stop you hitting them trees so let's hope I pay attention to it so um right three yes 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 there we go right five left three trees inside yeah I, I, can, I can handle it don't worry I can handle this 60 left four Ah, we're leading the stage. That's 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 good. That's good so far. Let's hope we can continue that and uh, yeah, maybe even get our first win of the stage. Well, first win of the rally, should I say? First stage win of the rally. Christ, James. Um, yeah, and uh, beat Citroen. You know, for the for, make sure the Citroen get beat for the first time here in Finland because they've won every stage so far. They've won quite a lot this season, Citroen, already, and, uh, yeah, this is uh, everything we need. Yeah, so, I think with this stage, if it stays as it is, 
you know, with me about a second ahead, I think, I think uh, Hivenon will take the lead of the rally, but we might move closer to, uh, to Augier. I don't know how close we'll move to Augier, and I don't know why the car snaps sideways. Yeah, yep, left five into right six. Let's hope that uh, little junction didn't uh, upset the balance of the stage too bad. It did, it upset it, upset it but not, not as bad as I thought it was, so... No, actually, Ogier, no, not Ogier, Hivenham won't take the lead of the rally, I've just seen the time difference between them. Uh, it's going to be closer, but uh, not by nearly as enough as Loeb needs. No, even a need, sorry. Okay, right five. I'm trying not to wreck this Fiesta, because uh, I do like the Fiesta. It's one of my all-time favourite rally cars. As we, yep. Yeah, that's... Um, yeah. Okay. I'm just trying to focus. How could I gain eight seconds in one sector? I'm going to take it anyway. I'm still going to be happy to finish, you know, you know, this far ahead of everybody else. But, uh, and take, probably take the lead of the rally. Only by, only by, a, only by a little. And it seems like the AI may have faltered again. Coming through these final few stages. We've got enough time so I can take that a bit quicker than I did last time. And we're coming to the end of the stage. We do win this stage and probably take the lead of the rally. Surprisingly. Eight point no, I don't I don't know, it's close. It's close. We do. We take the lead of the rally by nine thousandths of a second. And I knew it was close. Can we go for back-to-back -back rally wins? Stage 5 is coming up. That's going to be an important stage for us. Stage number 5, guys, here in Rally Finland. And, uh, yeah, stage number 4 was good for car number 4. So, um, yeah, I don't I don't know what to say about that stage. There's something, there's something not quite right about that sector. You know, um, the AI seemed to have... I don't know, they seem to be going at a snail pace. Have they, did they all crash down there or something? I, I don't I don't get it. Um, you think I, I shouldn't be complaining because I at least won the stage and took the lead of the rally, but... Uh, but it's... I don't know, it, it doesn't seem right that, you know, the AI loses that much time. Like, like in New Zealand, we gained it all with, you know, like two stages to go again. And we probably might lose it. Ah, oh, yeah, we can't, we can't afford to be making mistakes now if we want to win the, win the rally. I've just realised we're nine thousands of ahead, ahead and there's still plenty of rallying to go so it's going to be a close fight if we are going to win it and it's going to be a very epic fight I think. So remember we're nine thousands ahead so far going into stage number five and which is not going to be enough for us if that continues If we continue to lose time, it's not going to be good for us as we're sliding around these next few corners. Okay, there's a tree there, yep. Oh, that was that was close, that was close. I saw it, I was going to hit it, but uh, can I get... Yep, that's the junction that lost us about a second, or so, oh, just on, under a second last time by. Right four, keep middle, yep, sliding, sliding. Trees outside narrows, yep, indeed. Oh, so we've lost time, but we've moved up to P3. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know. I'll be happy to finish in the podium positions here in, in Finland. I'm not, I know I'm leading the rally as it is, but uh, 
my mindset's not in about winning it's just gaining points and being there and worrying the top few drivers in the championship so I should have from uh, you know uh, yeah from familiarized myself with the drivers championship going into this rally because at least then I would have been knowing what we would have had to been doing here in New Zealand uh, not New Zealand here in Finland Then right three. Left five. Open. And 80. Keep middle. Left six. I'm definitely going to keep middle somewhere. There we go. Keep middle. Yep. Right three. Long. Left four. Yeah, right three long. I nearly wrecked the car there slightly. And finish. Okay, so we finished P2 in that stage. We may have lost the lead of the rally, but that's not... A problem that is okay yeah we lost the lead of the rally but we've got one stage to go and eight tenths separate me and Sebastian Loeb for Rally Finland Havenan's dropped off the pace pace slightly but never count out the Finn never count him out in his home rally so eight tenths of a second Sebastian Loeb or Petter Solberg let me know in the comments down below guys who you think's gonna win this state this rally Stage 6, the final stage, is coming up right now. Okay, so here we are, the final stage here in Rally Finland. Eight tenths of a second between two greats of the WRC. Petter Solberg, which, to be fair, I'm driving as him, so I, I'm not really great, but uh, Petter Solberg or Sebastian Loeb. Well, and Sebastian Loeb, not all. Uh, he is leading the rally so far by eight tenths of a second. But that could all change here today. Well, here in this final stage. This is good. This has been an okay rally. It's been a consistent rally, apart from that we got probably got lucky with you know with the game, you know helping us out massively for some reason. I think you know through these final few stages. But uh, yeah, there we go. Keep middle. We s at the minute it, it's not enough. At the minute it's n is not enough to win the rally over Loeb. But uh, not not to worry, there's still plenty of uh, stage to go. It's the power stage as well, so there's bonus points on offer for winning this stage or finishing in the top three, so... There we go. Coming around these nice corners here, get, get that one right for once. Left four. Yeah, trees inside. Keep middle. That's nice through there. Yep. Okay, no, we're losing time to low, but I don't think... I don't think we're going to do it, guys, but... There's still plenty of rallying to go. Like I said, still plenty of stage to go here. So if I, if I go quiet, which I probably am going quiet, I'm just trying to focus and trying to win a rally here. So I'm sorry if, if I go quiet. Right three building outside. Yeah, I see it. Yes. We're keeping him within range, but it's not enough. We, it's not enough to to win the stage or the rally. Well, it's not enough to win the rally because there's eight tenths between us. He's going to gain tenths on us. So right three Titans. Yep. Okay, so we moved up to second. We're gaining time on him. We need to gain a lot more time on him through this next, this final sector. We've got so we. I don't. I don't think we're going to do it. I don't think we're going to do it. We, but we might. You, you never know yet. You never know. There's still, still anything can happen in the WRC. Yeah, 
Yeah, running very wide there is not going to help though, but... Uh, okay, so here we go, coming across the line. We finished second in that stage. We finished second in that stage. It's not enough. We get uh, points for finishing P2 though in the power stage, but I don't think that's enough. It isn't enough. We oh, come up just short here in Rally Finland by four tenths of a second over Sebastian Loeb. It's, it was a great fight with him. I, I've got to admit, it was a great fight with a Frenchman, the nine-time World Rally Champion. Well, nine-time as it is in 2017. But, um, yeah, after 20, 20 and a half minutes of rallying here in Finland, Sebastian Loeb wins the rally which takes his total up to 150 points at the top of the Drivers' Championship. He's gained six points on us going into a Rally Germany, which I'm not going to lie, I'm going to look forward to Rally Germany. So, Hevenen is keeping ahead of us, but only on bonus points for Rally, well, this Rally. Uh, yeah, so it's close. It's close. There's, there's like, I don't know, 22 points between us, between me and Loeb, so... Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you have liked it, hit that like button down below, only if you want to. And I will see you guys in Germany to start to kick off the final five rallies of the season. 22 points separate the top three. We can still win this championship if I, if I just hit my microphone. And I will see you later. Goodbye.